This is Janie Slash. I'm here at Texas Frightmare Weekend with MonsterCon TV. And right now I am talking to Max from the Pyramid Gallery. Hello. How are you enjoying the weekend so far? How's it going at Texas Frightmare Weekend? Always awesome at Texas Frightmare. You know, we love it. The crowds have been, uh, yesterday was really crazy with the crowd. So it's nice to get a breather today and uh, do an interview with you. Awesome. Yes. Thank you. Thank you for your time. I appreciate it. Um, tell us a little bit about the Pyramid Gallery. Pyramid Gallery is basically... Um, my kind of uh, obsession with uh, Philip Le Marchand, who was an 18th century uh, architect who designed these uh, music boxes. Um, he's basically the world's first serial killer, and he used human fat to uh, make the boxes. So it was that type of mythology that kind of pulled me into this when I was a young man and, you know, back in the 90s. So uh, it kind of grew into the table that we see today. Awesome. So uh, tell us a little bit about, you have individual different types of puzzle boxes. Which one is your favorite? Well, probably my favorite is the Lament configuration because it's the, um, you know, kind of the gateway to uh, Philip Le Marchand's uh, uh, creations. But, uh, we make music box versions of the Lament configuration. Um, we also um, feature many of the other uh, creations that he made. I think we have up to close to 50 different boxes on the website. Awesome. Um, I really, this red one right here, which one is this one? This one draws my eye. This that was uh, actually an art trade I did with my friend Derek Neal. He uh, makes those. That was in honor of Paul Kane's book, um, Sherlock Holmes and the Servants of Hell. So it's a novel that's out. It's basically a mashup of uh, Sherlock Holmes and the Hellraiser mythologies. That's awesome. Uh, how long have you been doing this? How long have you been making these boxes? I started making my own boxes for myself back in the late 90s and then... Um, I started selling them on eBay, and I started the website back in 2000. So, yeah, it's been 17 years uh, with the website. Awesome. So uh, you do a lot of conventions, right? Yeah, I do. So what makes Texas Frightmare so special that makes it stick out amongst the others? Well, I used to think that uh, Texas had the most Hellraiser fans in the world because we had such a great response here, but it really is about the numbers here. It's such a big convention, and um, Texas d does love their horror. So, yeah. What do you think keeps bringing people back? What keeps bringing you back here? Just the love and enthusiasm from all the people I meet here. You know, I've, it's, we've gathered a big fan base down here. So it's like, yeah, well, it'd be foolish not to return. Also, Texas, you know, invites us back year after year. This is our fifth year uh, here at Texas. Awesome, awesome. So out of all the wonderful guests here, is there anybody in particular that if you had a chance to meet that you'd love to meet? If I could get out, you know, beyond my table because I get trapped here, especially when I do a show by myself, I'd probably go to Malcolm McDowell first since he's here. I'm a big fan of uh, Kubrick, so... Uh, yeah, I love uh, Clockwork Orange. It's probably one of my favorite films. And The Shining, of course. Yeah, yeah he's fantastic. He's a super nice guy, too. That's what I've heard. Yeah, yeah. I think, yeah, I love his banner, too. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's the, the horror show or whatever it is from Clockwork Orange. Yeah, yeah. Vidi Well. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, so where can we purchase your, if you're not able to come out to a convention, where can we purchase your boxes at? Well, you can find me online at uh, www.pyramid-gallery.com. Do you design them or do you have specific artists? How does that work? Yeah, we work both. I, I've designed some, but I also work with different artists and writers. We've been, um, you know, going at it for like the past 17 years, you know, uh, exploring the uh, mythology of Philip Le Marchand. Awesome. Awesome. Um, oh, I appreciate your time and I appreciate you talking to me today. And I hope that you're having a great time here at Texas Frightmare Weekend and hopefully you'll be back next year. Always. Yeah, I'll be back. Definitely. Thank you. This is Janie. Yeah, thank you. It's Janie Slash at MonsterCon TV at Texas Frightmare Weekend with Pyramid Gallery. Thank you.